Hey there friends, on today's video we are going to be doing a quick walkthrough for the new Peacock streaming service. Let's do it right now. Okay, so I'm actually going to be looking at this on my web browser on my computer, but if you're using your TV and have downloaded the app and have signed in, this is going to look very, very similar. Now, the other thing I've done is I've upgraded to a premium account, so I have access to all of the shows. There's a seven-day free trial, and there's multiple options. There's a free version where you can only watch a couple of shows. There is a $4.99 per month version, and that will get you all the content with ads, and then there's a $9.99 option. That's the premium one. That's per month, and then you get access to everything minus the ads. Now there are a few of the shows and pieces of content on here because of streaming rights. They do have to put a little ad either before or after the show. So just be aware of that even with the premium service. It's kind of like Hulu. So what we're currently looking at is the home page. And again, like other streaming services, basically we're gonna have access to TV shows, different movies. We're going to have a kids section, news, sports, and then a Latino section. So again, just on initial inspection, this is going to look like most streaming services. I'll kind of scroll down here a little bit. Uh, again, the big one obviously is the office that just dropped on the service. It actually went away from Netflix. And uh, we also have, uh, so again, multiple show options that are here. We also have multiple movies. Uh, which is a kind of a nice uh, addition, so you're not just looking at specific shows. Uh, I'll scroll through just a couple of these so you guys can see what is currently available. This again will change on a monthly basis based off of who has the rights to these specific movies. We've got a feature film section. There's also a Peacock Originals section. Uh, you can see there's uh, Save by the Bell here. And again, I'll scroll over just a little bit so you can see again some of the original content that is being released on the platform. So we also have full seasons of shows here. Uh, we have different sections that are laid out. This is obviously popular situational comedy that's based off of jobs. We've got uh, current TV. This is stuff that's currently being uh, broadcast on network TV, binge-worthy comedies, epic dramas and so forth. So again, most of the stuff is just going to be different sections that the content is organized into. So if we come back up to the top here, we can go to just the movie section. And this is going to give us just a big list of all of the available uh, movies that are currently on here. Again, uh, I'll just kind of scroll down here a little bit. There's a ton to look through. If you go back up to the top, I'll click on the TV shows section. And this is where we're, you're gonna get a big variety of a bunch of different shows that are available on this specific platform. You can see we've got Saturday Night Live over here, Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Two and a Half Men, uh, Yellowstone, which is always getting really popular, and a few older uh, shows as well, like Battlestar Galactica. The kids section, up here is again going to be content specific for children and you can set up parental controls on here which is really nice so that your kiddos just have access to content that's approved for them. We've got a news section and this is going to be stuff like Dateline. You can see early morning uh, TV. Uh, we've got uh, all again all sorts of news shows that are specific uh, to the platform here. We've also got the sports section, and this is going to give us a couple of uh, Peacock Originals as well as a larger sports broadcast. Again, we've got a Top Stories uh, broadcast here. We've got uh, some Premier League highlights and uh, a few other sports-related uh, items. It does look like you're able to watch sporting events on the platform. Again, what I'm seeing is rugby and uh, some potentially Looks like some World Cup uh, skiing action as well. Looks like we have some football or soccer availabilities right here. American football is not yet uh, available as far as streaming the actual games, it looks like. And then lastly, we have the Latino section. And again, I'll just scroll through this really quick because it looks like there is a variety of shows that are available for the Latino crowd. 
Okay, I'm going to go back to the home page here, and uh, basically that's it. Again, that's a really quick walkthrough. Hope that helps. If it has, please give us a thumbs up. It lets us know we're making helpful content. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And you might want to subscribe because we're actually making a bunch of new Peacock tutorial videos that should be released here very soon. Thanks so much for watching.